What's up, y'all? Welcome back for another reaction video. In this video, we are going to be reacting to UFC 4 official career mode trailer. Let's get into it. I say what I got to say after the video. Hopefully, this career mode is file. Hopefully, it's something that I can get back into because I've been having, I've been having way too much fun on UFC 3 online. Ranked matches and quick matches are file. Um... The last UFC career mode I played was UFC Undisputed 2010. If y'all don't know what game that was, it was the game with Brock Lesnar on the cover. That was the last time I ever played career mode. Like, lots of fun back then. Lots of fun. But hopefully they changed a lot of things. Um, I never tried it in UFC 3, but I know they changed a lot of things. But hopefully they add some stuff in this game, like, uh, like um, conferences and all that, like... Like, just a lot of stuff you see nowadays, I want them to implement inside this career mode. Let's get into it, man. Let's get into it. Impress me, EA. Please impress me. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to check the links down below. And let's get into the video. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. In UFC 4, we've overhauled career mode to give you the most in-depth, authentic experience yet. Is that my haircut? So whether it be in or Just outside the octagon, every move matters on your journey to becoming the undisputed UFC I'm gonna champion. I'm going to get that haircut, though. I told you you'd make it to the big show. Now here we are. Introducing Coach Davis, our brand coach new interactive Davis. coach that will help you navigate the fight world while letting you experience the importance of the fighter-coach relationship. Okay. All right, Coach With Davis. With our all-new fighter evolution feature, Watch your character grow based on the disciplines that you choose to train with or fight with. Ooh. In career mode, feel this concept take control as every move you make improves your fighter in real time in terms of the damage dealt and aesthetics. We included five Fine, different sparring techniques so you choose which disciplines you want to master. Earn evolution points as you level up and use them to purchase perks, upgrade attributes, and regain attributes due to injuries in training oh. or in fights. Oh, Create okay. and develop the player how you want. It's all up to you. Let's go. The fight world is built though. on relationships. Enter our all new relationship system. With our main focus to improve the meta and strategy of the mode, experience okay. the drama, friendship, Motown. and oh, rivalries like as Kevin you navigate Lee. the fight world. The relationship with fighters, fans, sparring partners, and promoters all play an integral role in the success of your career. Hopefully, it's for social media to call out fighters to build hype for a fight or befriend them to invite them to your camp. Tyrone Need an overhand for your arsenal? Train with specific fighters to learn their moves Khabib. as you build your skill set. But be careful, you don't want to knock your friends out. Knocking out your sparring partner can cause a training camp feud, affecting how you train and who you can train with. Oh. But what a story it makes. It can also build notoriety within your fan base if you decide to build your brand as the villain. It's all a balancing act and UFC 4 puts you in the driver's seat. Good, good, yeah, you got this. No two fighter journeys are the same. In UFC 4, you choose your path through the UFC, the okay. whether it be through the amateur circuit, the World Fighting Alliance, or Dana White's Contender Series. Craft oh. your skill while chasing the belt in the WFA, or take a risk and jump straight to the UFC from Dana White's Contender Series. If you miss your shot and get cut from the UFC, you can revive your career by working your way back up through the WFA. That's Dominating cool. your entire weight class, move up or down to add another challenge to your career. Our all-new gameplay injury system also affects the decisions you make. Taking a short notice fight might put you at risk of suffering a severe injury and oh, shortening wow. your career. Okay. But maybe it's worth it to make a name for yourself. It's completely unscripted. You make the decisions. With our focus on authenticity and strategy, UFC 4's career mode will let you live the life of an MMA fighter as you climb the ranks to becoming the greatest of all time. Oh, two belts. Alright, so that that was really interesting. Like they 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 basically answered everything I really wanted in this career mode with some the conferences aren't really conferences where your player your like um like two K. Your player should be voice acted. He should have his own voice. Voice act this character, add some like like, make other UFC stars have their voices. Hopefully they do that, but I don't think they are. Like, look at 2K. Look how they... Look how they have their mode. Do it like that. Add some voice actors in there, you know, like... 
get some big stars from the UFC, have them voice act some lines, have a voice actor for the fighter, female and male, just do it like that and it would, I'm telling you, that would be better if y'all do it like that because this non-voiced guy is getting on my nerves, man. Like, I want to hear, I want to hear my dude, like, um, at the press conference or something, going against Nate Diaz or something, Khabib. Tony Ferguson, anybody, just have him, make him have a voice. That's the only thing I want in this game because even though 2K's voices are a little bit iffy sometimes, at least it's something, though. But UFC, it looks like the career mode is going down the right path. It looks like they're doing, like they really improved this. It looks, it's, it's looking really promising. It really is. It's looking really promising. And um, this might be the year I actually go back to career mode and play it again. Knowing knowing that they got all this stuff in the game, you know, and the only way that you can actually play it is if you play it on the um, hardest difficulty. And that's all. In my eyes, that's the only way that you could really have fun with the game because if you play it on normal, uh, it might not be a challenge. But if you play it on the hardest difficulty, then I think you would possibly be more like... Um, alert or like uh, aware of the things happening inside the octagon or something. It depends though. It depends on the player. It depends on if you're nice or not. I don't know. But yeah, this game is looking promising. Um, Just fix some animations. Fix some character models. And just improve on a lot of things. I wish this game was coming out on next gen. But it's not. It's, it's getting that backwards compatibility thing. Which is cool. But I really wish this game was coming out for next gen, but it's not. I already said that, but yeah. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to check the links down below. i see y'all in the next video. Peace.